You can remove blemishes using the spot healing brush tool or the clone stamp tool. But on this sample image, we're going to use the healing brush tool. The data file for this exercise is called removingacne.psd. On the canvas, you'll notice three acne spots. Let's start with the one on the forehead. But before we do, let's zoom in on it by selecting the zoom tool and zooming in on the acne. After you're done zooming in, let's return to the tools panel and select the healing brush tool. In the options bar, we're going to set the diameter of the brush to a size slightly larger than the size of the acne. We want to make sure that the hardness of the brush is set to 0% before we start editing. After setting the brush size and hardness, find an unblemished area near the pimple on the forehead to sample. After you do, Hold down the Alt key and click on that unblemished area. Go ahead and release the Alt key, then paste the mouse pointer over the acne on the subject's face and click on it once. We're going to repeat the same steps with the other two spots on the image file. So let's move the image file down without zooming back out by going to the Tools panel and clicking on the Hand tool. Click on anywhere on the image, then holding down the mouse, drag the image upward in order to show the bottom of the image. Now let's go back to the Tools panel and select the Healing Brush Tool again. Check the size of the Healing Brush Tool over the two acne spots on the face to see if it's big enough. It looks like the diameter of the brush tool is a little too big, so let's go up to the options bar and change the diameter to something smaller. Again, we want to keep the hardness at 0%. Let's move back over to the image and repeat the same steps that we did before in order to remove the acne on the forehead. Find an unblemished area, hold down the Alt key, sample that unblemished area, then after you release the mouse, click on the pimple in order to remove it. Let's see the results. Let's go back to the Tools panel and click on the Zoom tool. In the Options bar, click on the Fit Screen button. And now you can see that the sample image has no more pimples.